video of a dangerous creature in Gloucester. Look at this, a viewer capturing video of a large lion's mane jellyfish over the weekend. They have been spotted on several beaches across the state this summer. Frightening, and it's not clear why they're being seen more often in Massachusetts waters. Eric Swanson was on his boat a couple of miles off Gloucester yesterday when he first spotted this lion's mane jellyfish. He says this one was on the smaller side, did not have long tentacles. But then a short time later, he spotted something big on his boat's sonar, about 20 or 30 feet below the surface, which turned out to be this second lion's mane jellyfish. He says, look at those tentacles. They were incredibly long. It's certainly a good thing he did not get in the water to check it out in person. The first one, we jump, I jumped in and snorkeled around in video. The second one, I didn't even know it was a jellyfish at first. I saw something on the sonar. We dropped the line down, and there was this gigantic jellyfish with tentacles almost 30 feet long. That would have been dangerous to get tangled up in. Certainly. Well, lion's mane jellyfish stings are poisonous. You can still be stung even if the jellyfish has died. They can grow to five feet across with tentacles 100 feet long. Now, they generally prefer cold ocean waters, but so far this season they've been spotted off Nahant and Duxbury Beach. That